Rotro joins us now. And Robert, it's been a nice day today, and it's going to be pretty nice all week. I think so. And then the bad news comes, Tori. What's the bad news? It's going to be a little bit chilly, I think, for you. Not too bad, yeah. not cold, but Tory chilly. You know, I, I like fall, but, I mean. Yeah. yeah we're going to have a, a Tory <laughs> chilly weekend next week, and potentially. In fact, here's a sneak peek of, I guess what you could call the 8 to 14 day forecast so this would be beyond the seven day forecast at least the week after and it's hard to give you exact temperatures that far out but what we can do is show you a map of the areas that will be cooler than average and basically everywhere you see blue here on this map are areas that'll be cooler than average and so it looks like we go one two three four shades of blue so follow the legend up here one two three four so it could be darker blue but that's kind of in the middle of the pack. So expect some cool temperatures heading into next weekend, but really into the week thereafter. Now, we can try to give you temperature, actual temperature amounts, but just understand that you'll have to take these numbers with a grain of salt. So we'll start off this week above average, certainly. We're typically in the low 70s this time of year. So we're going to be at least 10 degrees above average, it looks like, moving into the next several days. Then we hit Thursday, Friday, Saturday. That's when we expect a cold front to move through. It could bring the chance for some showers. Otherwise, the rest of the week is dry. And then look at the weekend and into next week. Highs in the 60s and just really the low 60s. So most of the afternoon in the 50s. So, yes, that would likely be some sweater weather or Tory chilly outside. Outside, we're looking at some clear skies, 83 degrees, winds out of the east-northeast, about 7 miles per hour. And you can see it's not feeling too muggy. We're in that comfy range as far as the humidity is concerned. So not a bad day. Look at that beautiful clear sky all across the eastern United States and not really seeing any rain anywhere in the eastern United States. Maybe uh, Mackinac Island looks like saw so a little bit up that way. But main reason is because of a strong area of high pressure that keeps the skies clear, it keeps the weather nice, and that's what we have more or less right over Ohio, not directly, but right around that area. So let's move the future cast here into the next several days. The time's going to move. You don't see much else happening. I mean, barely any clouds, certainly no rain. Now we're into Tuesday. Look at that. Some cloud cover Tuesday afternoon. Not a lot, though. So it's pretty quiet here moving into the next several days. 58 for the low tonight. Clear and pleasant. The next seven days, you can see, we stay sunny. We stay warm. Then that front comes through later in the week. Brings some showers late Friday into early Saturday. Low temperature, 40 degrees, which means some of you, especially north of, I would say, I-70, are going to be in the 30s.